one Chelsea bid knocked back as two clear favourites emerge. The Ricketts family have reportedly had their bid to buy Chelsea knocked back, while another story claims they are expected to make the shortlist of bidders. Roman Abramovich put Chelsea up for sale on March 2 amid Russia's continued invasion of Ukraine. The Russian-Israeli billionaire was then sanctioned by the government on March 10, with Downing Street claiming to have proven his links to Vladimir Putin. The Blues must operate under strict government license, with Abramovich unable to profit from Chelsea's sale. Downing Street must approve another new license to authorize Chelsea's eventual sale, with the money either frozen or distributed to charitable funds to aid victims of the war in Ukraine. Abramovich has pledged to write off Chelsea's £1.5 billion debt, and the bidding frenzy for the club could see the eventual deal hit £3 billion. The Financial Times claims that the Ricketts family have had their bid for the club knocked back, and that a consortium led by US billionaires Josh Harris and David Blitzer, and an investor group led by Todd Bowley are now the two clear favorites to land the club. Despite that, the Press Association insists that Chicago Cubs owners the Ricketts family are expected to make the shortlist being drawn up by New York merchant bank The Rain Group. Pa add that Sir Martin Broughton and Bowley have had their bids shortlisted in the auction to buy the Premier League club. Rain spent Thursday informing a host of unsuccessful bidders they were out of the auction before starting the process of confirming the shortlist in the race to buy the Blues. The New York bank will dig into further details of remaining submissions once the shortlist is rubber-stamped. U.S. magnate Bowley and his Eldridge Industries firm has backing from Swiss billionaire Hans-Jörg Wyss and respected British business leader Jonathan Goldstein. Former British Airways chairman Broughton has drafted in sports business and politics heavyweight Lord Sebastian Coe, adding genuine clout to his consortium. Wall Street investment banker Michael Klein has added a major financial edge, with a number of other backers also involved. The Cubs owning Ricketts family boast the financial muscle of U.S. hedge fund supremo Ken Griffin, believing their experience of renovating storied stadium Wrigley Field offers an edge in their candidacy, given Stamford Bridge's required rebuild.